Tonight at 6, though, a popular restaurant accused of racism. An African-American woman claims workers at J. Alexander's violated her civil rights and should be fired. 7 Action News reporter Brian Abel tells us how the dispute unfolded in West Bloomfield. She had just ordered her drink. She was sitting at the bar waiting for a friend to sit next to her when she says the bartender pointed to the seat she was sitting in, telling two white customers looking for seats that they could sit there. What happened next is what's leading her and her attorney to call racial discrimination. You're Cell phone video taken by Leah Gant on June 20th, moments after getting asked to leave Jay Alexander's in West Bloomfield. I was told to move out of my seat for two other white men to be seated when I did not get up for her to say I am not going to serve you and I had done nothing wrong. It made me feel invisible when she refused to give up her chair. She says this happened next. She took my beverage from in front of me and the side drink that comes with it and said I'm not going to serve you took it and threw it in the sink. Then this disturbing moment. <laughs> Oh, he threw that. Food thrown after Gant says she talked to a manager and was still forced to pay the bill for the drink that was thrown away and shown the door. Inside today, a manager declining to comment, referring us to Jay Alexander's Holdings, the parent company, and West Bloomfield Police confirming they are investigating the complaints. This type of behavior is archaic racism, reminiscent of the black men and women in the 1950s sitting at the lunch counter. I asked Ms. Gant's attorney if they plan on filing a lawsuit. They say at this time, all they want is for the employees involved to be terminated. Reporting West Bloomfield, Brian Abel, 7 Action News. Brian, thank you. Jay Alexander sent us a statement. It reads in part that our staff made every responsible effort to safely diffuse this incident in the face of profanity and misbehavior directed at them. Goes on to say that none of our employees used profanity, made racial remarks, or threw food, but certain guests did. The restaurant says it has turned over security surveillance to police. You can read the entire statement from Jay Alexander's on our website, wxyz.com.